Hey, what's up, everybody? My name is Jacob Restituto. I'm a singer, a musician, and a producer from Long Island, New York. Today, we're in my studio, and I'm going to be reacting to Ariana Grande's new song, Break Up With Your Girlfriend, I'm Bored, off her new album, Thank You, Next. All right, let's see what we got. Ooh. Nice 808. Comes right, right in with a hard 808. You got me some type of way. Ain't just a feeling this way. So... Right off the bat, sounds really cool. Comes in really punchy with the 808 and the drums. What's really cool about this, and I want to mention this because you, it, 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 you heard it once and you heard it just now again, is the the mmps, like the, the ad libs in the background, they're recorded in stereo. And the way you can get that is you record a couple different takes of them and then you pan them in different sides of the, the, um, the stereo system and um, or the, the stereo spectrum, sorry. And it gives this really cool effect because every time you record a vocal, it's never going to be exactly the same as if the first. So what happens is there is different characteristics of each of them. So with that, you know, it gives this really full effect because they're not exactly the same. I do not know what to say. Yeah, yeah. You can hear it again right there. Nice synth. Interesting. Like a mono synth sound. So right now, you hear the, the mono synth sound, which is pretty cool sounding, and then also the drums went from like a full drum sound to with only like a, a low pass kind of, or actually it's more like a mid-range um, kind of sound where it's not super bassy, and the highs are taken off the drum, so you get that kind of that feel. And then also right here, I want to rewind it really cool. She does that... Uh, the minor third note, um, and she where she bends down, and it's it's a really it's like a classic. Um, you hear it a lot in music, especially like guitar bends do it a lot. Uh, guitarists do it a lot with guitar, the bending the, the notes, but it's a really cool effect if you can nail it. Right here. So it's actually not part of the key, but because it, it, it's just one of those notes that fits really well. A lot of vocals in this track, different harmonies. Oh, that was cool. You hear the echo and the care. There's like a guy singing care and like a whole stack of maybe 16th note uh, delay. Right there. A lot of ad libs. Almost like a rap. Cool harmony right there. Oh, you, can, you can hear the uh, the synth um, phasing, like going in and out of phase. Or flanger maybe. There. Back to that mono synth sound. So yeah, this is a low pass. So the lows are going through on the drums. Get the weights back in. Echo cool. So the whole bunch of different vocal takes and they're actually stacking on top of each other and almost making this vocoder type sound, which is cool. Oh, nice. So right there we have like a, a 16th note um, drum beat going, the one E and that, 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 and what you do, what she did is that, is they actually did a, a, a again, a low pass filter and um, low pass filter means that only lows can pass through and the high frequencies get rolled off, like you, you can't hear them. And what that, that's probably a snare drum probably. Um, and what it does is it gives you that effect where the high frequencies aren't being heard and only the lower parts being, and it gives it a really interesting sound. You can hear it. You can hear 
right right towards the end they were starting to get a little brighter the drums the high pass I thought, sorry the low pass was panning a little higher right here listen the drums just got a little brighter the bass notes on the the 808 are really catchy That was cool. Yeah. Vocal. Sweet, that was pretty sick. The production on that, whoever produced that, did a really good job. Alright, cool. So my name is Jacob Restituto. Hope you enjoyed this. If you have any requests for songs you'd like me to review next, send me a message.